Welcome to the Old Timer Centre. My name is Philip Tarrant and I'm going to be talking to you about this beautiful 2010 Audi Q7. Being a 2010 it's got the updated LED tail lights and this particular car is black in colour with cream interior. It's done 97,000 kilometres and probably one of the best things about it is the condition. There are quite a few Q7s around, but to find one in good condition is quite difficult. I think it, you know, is one of those cars which ticks all the box and then it's got two keys. It's got the three litre turbo diesel engine. It was optioned without a sunroof, uh, which I think is a good thing because when they get of age, they can be expensive to repair if there's a problem with the panoramic roof. The condition inside and out is very good especially for a car with cream interior. It does have a reverse camera. It's got the two original remote keys and a very good history. I have driven it, it drives absolutely perfectly. And it's just been really well looked after. Yeah, we're really quite happy when this came in. Uh, it does have tinted windows. And it's basically standard, it hasn't been modified in any way. It doesn't have a tow bar, which I think is a good thing. They do have a big towing capacity, these Q7s, and there's every chance it might have been pulling a boat, which means putting it in the water. Which, you know, again, salt water, you know, if it's been going into salt water every, every month or every other month, over the past few years, you can have issues with rust. But it's just a nice, clean car. It's a seven-seater. And I think it's a very good value for money, especially for, you know, an update. A lot of them I find are silver and grey. So it's also really nice to have a black one. Your access into the back is very easy. You can see the seats forward at the moment. To clip it back in, one, two. It's very easy. You heard the plane fly over, we're in Marrickville. We're only 15 to 20 minutes from Sydney Airport. But everything from the carpets to the leather is very good. The logbook I took photos of. It's just a very impressive car. It looks like it's been garaged from what I can see. The headlights are nice and clear. The paint, the black paint's very good. It's nice and glossy. See the headlights nice and clear there, they're almost like mirrors. Obviously it's a Quattro. I've spoken to people with these Q7s. You know, I spoke to a country person last year and they had a three litre turbo diesel 2008 and that had 260,000 kilometres. And uh, they said it's still going very well and they've got no intention of, of selling it. So to me that would suggest that this has a long life ahead of it as long as you look after it. I think it's got the colour combination a lot of people like and the condition that you want without extras like the sunroof and adjustable suspension and things. It does have um, one extra though which I think is quite good which is your distance cruise control which basically means that you can set the cruise control on the freeway and if the person in front of you slows down or breaks suddenly the car will break itself because I think what we all find on the freeway is you know you're going 110 you set the cruise control to 110 and you keep you know and then you slowly approach the car in front of you then you've got to overtake it and then it just keeps happening over and over again if you set the distance cruise control if they're going slightly slower the car will just adapt so you're not changing lanes continuously but it's a very nice car from every angle and it's not something I think will last very long in this condition if you have any specific questions about the car, please give us a call. Uh, we're contactable on 02-9569-9999. We are the Old Timer Centre. We specialise in European cars. And uh, we are quite fussy with the cars we buy. It does have front and rear parking sensors as well as the camera. Thanks again for watching.